Hello everybody and welcome back to uh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team. We are in the post game. Question is, oh well, the thing is, I have not played the post game for about 10 years and the knowledge of it, or well, my knowledge of it is very rough because what I used to do was just used to, like my short attention span when I was a kid, playing Red Rescue Team on my, you know, Game Boy Advance SP. Um, I used to basically just get bored because I was like, oh, and... So I didn't think there was any story after I complete the game. So I used to be like, okay, on to the next game, and then come back to it, be like, okay, new save. So yeah, I don't know much of what's behind, uh, what's after, or what's the post game, is apart from obviously recruiting all the Pokemon, which is the main goal I thought. So yeah, this could be a fun experience for both of us because I have no idea what happens when I press this button. Okay. Oh yeah, apart from one thing, which is I remember you get the ability to evolve, which we'll probably see soon. Um, due to Alex and Volts' heroic actions, the falling star was destroyed, and peace returned to the world of Pokemon. It, uh, but that did not put an end to the natural calamities. Natural disasters still occurred, but much less often. Needless to say, Terravolt's rescue activities continued as if nothing had changed. Because we need the game to continue on, so you have reasons to play it. To play it. Several mornings later. Boo, ba -da boo. I've been listening to the soundtrack for this game in my own time. It's just like in the background while I'm doing something else. It's quite peaceful. Um, good morning. Did you just wake up? I went to buy the Pelipper post office earlier. The bulletin board was still covered by we rescue jobs. Even though it's peaceful again, many Pokemon still need our help. Let's keep um, doing our best as always. Okay. Alex. Oh, hi Caterpie and Metapod. What's the matter? It's Snubble. There's something weird going on. Snubble is weird? Weird how? Okay, and let's remember how to use Metapod, um, what Metapod sounds like. Going back into the deeps of my childhood knowledge, remember? Okay, and I've got it. He looks completely different. Um, uh, let's go to the square. Yeah, I remember Metapod, like, Metapod. I just remember, like, the old, um, I remember the Meta, the great Metapod battle between Ash and the, sa the Samurai Kid. Hey, anyway. Al Hi, Alakazam. Al Alexam, have you seen Snubble? I heard something strange happen to him. Oh yeah, 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 okay, and this is where we're going to learn about evolution. Cool. I'm Snubble. What? You're Snubble? You don't look anything like the way you did before. I don't really understand either. Go into the cave there and all of a sudden. What cave? It appeared with a- oh. Um, what, what, the, what voice did I give Whiskash? I think, then I give him the, the Pegasus voice? It appears without any, without me noticing. See, right there. So, you went in there. Yup. I came out looking like this. Snubble underwent evolution. He evolved. Evolution? Evolved? I don't follow. Pokemon under satisfying certain certain conditions may evolve. When a Pokemon undergoes evolution, it appears it its appearance changes. Oh wow. Well to be fair, I guess if this is your like first Pokemon game and you've just picked it up, not knowing it's like Different, it's different from the mainline Pokemon games. This is a nice way to explain evolution to newcomers, I guess. Oh, wow. Your own appearance. That can change? I suspect that cave is where evolution can take place. This is merely a guess. Perhaps evolution could not take place before the world's balance was askew. He says, being an Alakazam, a fully evolved Pokemon. Same with Wishcash, you know... Technically, same with any gener uh, any Pokemon we meet that has a baby form, 
in later generations. Like, we've got Sudowoodo, we recruit Sudowoodo, so technically, you know, Bonsly is a thing. He could have evolved from that. Although, to be fair, you can still evolve Sudowoodos from, or you can still get Sudowoodos from eggs, so. Comsi, Comsa. Um, <clears throat> anyway. Perhaps evolution could not take place before the world's askew. However, now that the star's been destroyed, the world's balance has been restored. And perhaps the cave has become unsealed. So if I evolve, would I become like Metapod? I wish. I want to be better free quickly. Wait a second. I don't know if I like this or not. My cute little face turned all craggly. All craggy. Evolution is not a bad thing. Appearance isn't the only thing that changes for evolution. One power and abilities may be enhanced, for example. Oh, really? I, uh, I might be stronger. That makes me want to evolve even more. I wish I could be better free soon. Don't we all, buddy? Don't we all? Me too. Aw, I don't want Cappy to evolve. Look at that beautiful little face and the eye and the stars and everything. Okay, can we move? Okay. Can we evolve if we go into that cave? Yes, but it will depend on the conditions. Alex, <clears throat> let's go in the cave and see if we're ready to evolve. I don't think I am, but it de I'm taking it with... De I don't know if the stone evolutions make sense in this game. Entrance is only... It's too narrow. There's only room for one. Okay, what am I meant to do then? Until I... Entrance is only two now, only room for one. Come alone to enter. Oh, okay, and so I, I can't go in at this moment in time. Because he's following me. I assume. What I'm meant to do is tell him to go away. So I, like I say, I, I can't remember. I remember doing this. Only when I was very young. Okay, and so I guess I have to come alone. I have to go come back alone. I spare that cave is where evolution takes place. You enter that cave, you wish to evolve. I'm assuming because we're together and none of us can evolve, that might be telling us basically get out. I don't know how to evolve stone evolutions uh, in this game. I don't know if they are a thing. As in, like, are there stones items we can get? Because we've not come across them. As of yet. Maybe I'll have a look up of them. Maybe later. Pieces returned. There's one thing we gotta do first though. Nice. Take all of this money and spend it all on friend areas. It's peaceful again. Thank you. I never expected less from you, my friend. Like to add some new friend areas. And now, behold everything. <laughs> um, I don't remember what actually holds it or what uh, is in these ones. In, partic in particular, the ones I, the only ones I do know, I think, are this, and they are all of the unknowns. So, age chamber, an and zero. I think these are unknowns. Hence, why an, you know, basically telling you what letters go through here, and zero to question mark. Apart from that, I mean, we've met some Pokemon who are from these places. Like we know that Mount Clef is um Aaron, I think, yeah. How about we get some of the ones that we know that people are at? So, Mount Clef, purchase. You see why I was hoarding money now? For how much these, these these things cost? Scorch Plains, a lot of fire types. Yeah, Rapidash, Growlithe, Arcanine. Probably should have picked a couple of a Pokemon. Ooh, hello there. I'll be taking that. Uh, Tilt Shell Pond, Azuril. Uh, I know Squirrels here, I think. Mystic Lake. Um, we, none of these I don't think are legendary things. So if we encounter a legendary and recruit it, it won't be, the, it won't be, uh, any different. I think the legendaries have their own little realms. Echo Cave, Cryptic Cave, and there's only one. Okay, and place your bets. Who is the Cryptic Cave? Pokemon. I have no idea, by the way. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking now. 
My hands are definitely not looking it up. I promise you. Uh, ancient Relic. Aerodactyl Baltoy. I saw one Ancient Relic, dude. I think that'd be nice. Okay. And now we bought free friend areas and now we are penniless again. Ah, uh, gotta love Pokemon. Okay. Don't it? You're the greatest, really. I think. Because that, like you say, now we've evolved. And then there's these people around here. We've got some stuff to do. So a Sky Tower. Ooh, that's nice, actually. That's a flame. Ooh, that's really nice. Sad and lonely. I want to see Stantler. I mean, we're doing it for the points, aren't we, at the moment? What have we got? There is free and uproar forest, so we gotta do these first. So it's five, six, and seven. Okay, cool. Looks like we've got a job to do. I can't remember when Cubone evolves, to be fair. Um, five, six, and seven. It's uproar forest. Who are we taking? We need to level some, some of these boys up. I can't remember when Magnemite evolves. I believe it's around level 30. So we'll take that. We'll take him. We'll see if we can recruit any of the any of the boys. Lighting up Broth Forest. Oh yeah, wait a second. There's something I wanted to talk talk to you before we go on a dungeon. Okay. You know how we always go to gun dungeons together. But I think we we'll be seeing all sorts of new dungeons from now on. I think some of them will be tougher even us. So I have an idea. Instead of us running. Okay, there's Metacham just randomly in the off screen. Did you guys see that? Instead of us running things all the time, we should let the team do um we should let the team as a whole do it. How about we change things from so we can pick the leader and the members into go, go into dungeons? That might mean we don't we won't be going on rescues to certain dungeons, but that will, but that will let us handle rescues better having more Pokemon types available. Do you agree with the idea? Yeah. Okay, Newell can now fit the Pokemon. Yeah, if you should pick the leader of who's going to be the team in a friend area, make a leader, and then you can be that person, I believe. One more thing, make it so the team leader can go into a dungeon alone if he wants. Anyway, to choose the leader of a dungeon bound team in a friend area, use make leader. Yep. Yeah, I just saw Metacham on the background. <laughs> and Lombre amuses me so. Oh, long time no see. Are you well? You see, I heard about Lombre's tail. It is too funny. Heard that Lombre almost drowned at sea. But the Lombre, he lives in water. How very prophetic. <laughs> okay, talk to Lombre, I guess. You okay, Lombre? Huh? What's that? Oh, you mean what happened at sea? It wasn't drowning. Sheesh, they're making up stories about me. Want to know what really happened? Yes. See, I went out went out to see you to frolic a while back, you know? I was trying that dive thing. So I was having fun going underwater, and I got washed out to see a bit. All of a sudden, these wicked cl clouds rolled in. Before I knew it, there was a full-blown storm raging. There's more. A dungeon appeared in the sea. I was shocked. Witless, I got out of there fast. But who'd have guessed it? A dungeon in a stormy sea. Huh? You want to know more about the dungeon in the sea? I have a moose out of there, so I can't tell you much. I know. Maybe Whiskash and a woman know something. Okay, and I think this is, might be how we get new dungeons. Yeah, that'd be the best. Go talk to Whiskash. Okay, let's go talk to Whiskash. How we doing, Whiskash? Aha! So you wish to know about the dungeon in the sea? I too have heard of it. And I have heard of a place that is far off our coast. It is a sea churned by violent, uh, tur tur churned by vi torrential storms and violent waves. Got ahead of myself there. Um, it's a place appropriately named the Stormy Sea. There are none who will find a dungeon that leads to the bottom of the sea. The sea is an infinitely dark and its depth unimaginable. That is what I have heard. Oh, 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 you look eager to go. However, to go beneath the sea, a hidden machine named Dive is needed. Without Dive, you cannot go to see the stormy sea. 
Your face tells me you're desperate to go. So be it. You may have this. Oh, he gives us a dive. Nice. I understand that it is a very rare item. It was found in a place called Solar Cave. If you wish to carry that hidden machine... If you were to carry that hidden machine as an item, or if any team member wishing to enter the dungeon use that hidden machine to learn dive, you will be able to enter the Stormy Sea. Hooray, but where you must need to uh, take HM dive, or a team member who must learn dive, as a move for a team to enter. That's nice, though, that you can actually, you know, have dive. Um, You don't need to actually learn, a, learn dive to actually go there. But now we can go to the Stormy Sea if we want. But we got some up for our forest stuff to do first, I've decided. Gotta get that rank up. Ooh, cool. I did not know we got all of these. I'm assuming these are all going to be bigger dungeons that have legendaries at the end of them. So Stormy Sea, Generation 3, Stormy Sea, it's either probably going to be Lugia or, well, mo most likely Kyogre. I should have thought of Kyogre first. One of my, my background on my computer monitor is actually a, a nice little um, picture of the, it's like a, 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 sh a, ship at a ship at sea on a stormy sea and a wave comes up. So you, you see a sh um, the ship on, up, up on a wave, but you see below the wave is Kyogre. Oh, did I just pick stormy sea accidentally? And soon she must have dive. Yep. Can you not screw me over? Thank you. Good to know. Up our forest is what I meant. Hmm. Wimple joined. Game okay, well. Nice. Maybe we can get Venom up. Oh. Can you not? Okay. Remove the C dot from view, and let's see if we can get out of these out of this thing. Oh, an APOM. Oh, I don't know if we've got an APOM yet. APOM's one of those, like... I used to love APOM as a kid. And I, like... I, I, know, I didn't watch much of the Johto show, but... Because Ash had him in, um... Like, for a long period. Not... Was it in Johto? Oh, I didn't remove all my stuff, did I? Ooh, that's going to hurt. I sh completely forgot about that. Well, it's only a blast seed. We're not going to lose that many items. Yeah, rem reminder. Always, always. Remember. To put items with Kangaskhan. Before leaving for a dungeon. Imagine if we could have gone to the Stormy Sea. That would have been an issue. Okay, let's see if we can get the Venonat. Uh, just go with a Boomerang. Oh, yeah. Because we don't need to search the forest anymore, I don't think. Or... Unless we're searching for specific items, but I could do that in my own time. Can we not? Because I have Wormpull. And Wormpull doesn't do well with... Anything. Yep. Yeah, and I get pulled out. Brilliant. Okay, and we're back. We just did um, all the, like, the little bit things were like we've actually you know got put our items back now so now we actually just have an item space that looks actually better than what i did before and then i need to put that uh stamina band on me and i thought hey ho well while we're here may as well go and get you know no chance going over stomping over old ground let's go to the stormy sea and check it out we have dive now Whiskash, give it, give it, give it as, you know, as a, a kind gesture. Let's see if we can find out what's here. I'm just imagining a Cubone in little, like, snorkel gear. Damn it. Because one of corner. Oh, that's on me. I accidentally clicked the thing for picking out a save file.
Oh, praise Lord Helix. I didn't realize. Damn, he takes a hell of a lot of damage. But gives off a hell of a lot of XP. I don't think we should search around here. I don't, well, because I don't know how strong the Pokemon are, but. And he picked up a stamina band, and like I said, there are a lot of po what, poison types, case in point why I picked. Uh, up a Petra Berry. Probably should have picked up a couple in all fairness. Oh, hi, Omanite. Hi, Omanite. I don't know if we can get them. Maybe we can because we got... Didn't we get the, um... Was it Relic Cave? Or whatever, whatever it was called. That got Aerodactyl. So I'm assuming, because it's Relics, we could probably get Omanite? Question mark? Oh, Wingle's here. Hang on, there's... That's what I was hoping for. Okay, and I'm about to die. If you don't know why I thought I was about to die, it's because... Shelda has a... Um, or... I don't know if it... Yeah, he'll have it in this game. Shelda has the ability to use Skill Link. Oh, its ability is Skill Link, which means all multiple hit moves get hit five times. So that Icicle Spear, basically he was hitting for a, a huge bit of damage. Okay, I'm just going to chuck this and hope for the best, trying to get it out my, uh, out my inventory. I don't know how deep these some of these like dungeons go. I'm assuming they're bigger than Sky Tower. Or around the same. Ooh, hello there. Scope lens. That increases accuracy, correct? It's a competitive critical hit for moves, okay. I guess I could use that when I face Um whatever his face is. I'm taking as a legend at the end of this. Like, I'm assuming it's not just a dungeon with a with a bot, you know, with no bottom. Okay, and here goes nothing. I don't know if I can. There we go. We got his attention. Go Pikachu. Why I get rid of um? Damn, that's two missed Thunderbolts. Three missed moves, actually. You just, just want to step on this here, Pikachu? Go talk about it. Okay, Bone Club. Nice. Just let him regain his whatever you want to call it. Okay. Ooh, TM. What do we got? Return. It's all right. I can put it on Tauros so we might get something out of it. I don't know how return works when the moves you have are... Oh, I don't know if, like, I, I don't know if friend, I don't know what friendship's like in this game. I should basically have a, be having a look when certain Pokemon evolve and when they don't. But I'm trapped, you know, I don't want to waste time. Waste enough of me dying in Upra Forest. Because, you know, who knew? One, I had to get bad weather. <laughs> Two, it's Wormpool. Okay. I'm sorry, Shelda. I just like money too much. Plus, we have to get a lot more friend areas. Is what it is. Oh, cool. My, one of my favorite Gen 3 Pokemon. Anorith. Um, no, don't chuck Boomerang. Trust me. Um, basically, I could have just lost two Reviver Seeds there. Um, okay. I love that move. Brick Brick. Oh, yeah, it's normal damage. I was thinking it was Rock and Water for some reason and not Rock and, um, Bug. 
to be fair, Anarif does have a lot of um, type coverage when it comes to moves. It's got a very diverse moves set. Oh no! Maybe we can get like one of them, like Anare, Farmaldo, Cradley. Who knows? Okay. Past that 10 mark. Oh, stepped on Gummy. Have we filled our thing up? That. Okay. Okay. Nice. I didn't realize we'd fill it up so much. Okay. Well, Magnemite, you about to get real clever. I still can't remember if we get a bigger thing once we hit, like, um, gold. I'd like a bigger toolbox. I don't know if we get it. Like I said, post-game, I basically have no experience. Please do not confuse me. Thank you. That's a dead end. And here they come. Okay. Get rid of one. Yeah, I had a feeling that might happen. Seriously, one damage? That cannot be a seal. Okay, and I really need to... Yep. That's me not paying attention. I'm just thinking of why these Pokemon are so strong all of a sudden. Oh, that serves me right for not using my moves. You don't have the ice yet, do you? The fact that's only three damage is worrying. Well, we almost died to a seal and an anora. You know how it goes. And we did lose two reviver seeds for doing that, but we can always get some more, hopefully. seem to be the best place for farming money. Game off we got. Stamina band. We are giving us a lot of health items now, I know, I've noticed. These last few dungeons. Um, damn. Oh wait, I do have something for this. Seriously, how many Thunderbolts are you going to miss? Take a Magnemite, the levels, um, on level 17. It's level 30, I want to say, that Magnemite evolves into Magneton. Love a dead end. We all like a dead end, don't we? Beautiful. Okay, and I don't know. I thought I was going to be- I thought I was dead then for a second, um... Yeah, I got nothing. Apart from... God, I- don't you just love missing moves? How strong does this game think Seal is? Legitimately. I'm just gonna heal up. I need to get to what's his name. I need to move Pikachu up with me. 
My slowness is annoying me. Yep. I thought that might be a problem. Finally! I was gonna say. How many Thunderbolts have we missed so, so far in here? You wouldn't think the Thunderbolt would be missing so much, but it's not even like we're getting accuracy drops as well. Of course he does. Well, at least they're not hitting me. In detect band. How much faith do I have in Magnemite? A lot, apparently. Oh, I was hoping we might get a slowpoke. I do like a lot of these, a lot of these, a lot of these guys. Oh yeah, I forgot because he's a water Pokemon, they can just walk through. Fortunately, I don't think we've, or unfortunately, I don't think we've even recruited a water Pokemon yet, have we? Maybe we just got unlucky on what water Pokemon we ran into. I just want to gander at this place before we uh, inevitably fail. I don't know how many flaws this is, this could be 150 flaws. I have no idea. Well, thank God he hit you with water gun, not me. Okay. Exit. 15 floors, stormy sea. What are we saying then? 30, 35? In. One thing I have learned is do not try and trade hits with these guys because they hit harder than you are. Or, or you can. Oh. Ooh. We appear to be in a spot of bother. Although I do like a seal. Well, a seal. At least that's doing actual damage for a chain. Just wanted to be sure that I'd kill. I was very worried for a second. And we got another iron berry. Yes, we do. Cause I would like that. I'd like that very much. How are we doing on belly? Brilliantly, we're doing on belly. And we get some gravel rocks for good measure. In Wonder Tile. Tell you something I've been figuring, uh, working out recently. Um, because I, like I said about the, I've been getting a Sega Mega Drive. Oh, I got a Sega Mega Drive. I'll oh, finally have a working one. We had a Sega Mega Drive, just didn't work. Um, I was looking at other consoles we can get. Cause I was trying. I was like, what games or what like consoles have I? Never seen before. One minute, I've never seen that before. What's in a law seed? A food item that gives Pokemon the cross eyed status. He also slightly fills the Pokemon belly. What does cross eyed status mean? <laughs> so, I mean, I have no idea. Money? Mr. Krabs. Gotta get the money. Anyway, um, yeah, I was looking at what, like, other game consoles I could get. Like, stuff like, um,. Like, I missed out on the PS3 this because I didn't have, or I was never really bothered about what console I got as long as I could play like Pokemon and I was happy. So I, I had the Wii when I was younger and again, a PS3 or an Xbox were um, okay. And I can only use these moves for now until the Encore's gone. Yeah, uh, I. Like, we had a, an Xbox that my brother had. My brother, unfortunately, broke the Xbox. He was ne he's not really one I would trust <laughs> with caring for technology. Okay, throw that to him. Nice. More gravel rocks. Greatly appreciated. Um, 
but yeah, we I never got a PS3, so there's a lot of good games that I missed out on. Uh, even on the Xbox games, I missed out on there because I just I and like it's my brother's console doesn't mean you're gonna get a chance to play on it. And like I think I've, I think I've told the story before how I got banned from um, playing on my brother's Xbox by the by uh, being a terrible driver on GTA and accidentally running over women. Or the what do you want to call them? What is what is the PC term nowadays? Lady of the night? I think I can get away with that. And it wasn't it wasn't deliberate. It was just I was a really bad driver. Um. Oh, I meant to use the gravel rock. Okay, and well, Pikachu, you you've got the type advantage. Go get him. Oh, I'm sorry. I really like that. Who's can I? He does, he does like the soy face. When he gets hit. Oh, my star, I mean, not Pikachu. Yeah, I've been going looking at a. The minute I was looking at PS3 and I was looking at the games I could get on there. And that led me down a rabbit hole of like uh, a bunch of games that were on Xbox and free, Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3 that we just don't have anymore. Like, um, I was looking at the old. Really? Can I not hit that dude for anything? Okay. Yeah, I was looking at like the the Spider-Man games that I remember growing up. Like uh, my uh, cousin that we used to go around uh, after school because my auntie used to pick me up. He had like uh, Xbox 360. And I remember there's some there's some very like vivid memories that I have of that time. So the one I remember is the big one I remember is a uh, Tomb Raider. That's like I remember go running up. Putting my like little bag down that they used to give us, and going up to his to play Tomb Raider. I'm just gonna eat the gummy. Um, and then another game was the all like this like obviously the Spider-Man games like Spider-Man Two, which is um I think it's a, I think it's a really probably my favorite game like that's a superhero game outside of probably the Arkham games. It's pretty damn good. Um. What do we want to toss? Eat, an, uh, eat the plain seed. I don't know how much it fills the belly. See, not full, so we've got away with it. Let's get up. Hello, Grimer. Wow, Magnemite does not do a lot of damage, does he? Should be beefing him up a little bit more, shouldn't I? I don't think rare candies though. Oh, I've not seen any rare candies so far in this game, so we can just breeze through. Oh, I think we found it. And a boy, You're getting very fortunate where these stairs are. I feel like I am anyway. Damn it! I pressed B on the chance that I would be able to bone meringue him, like so. And we got lucky that Mudshot there missed. Because so I think if Mudshot had um, hit, we would... Okay. I... He t His BO knocked me sick and now I am... What was it? Whiffed off? This is what I mean. I, half, this, half of the conditions in this game I've not even ever heard of. No. No. Gravel rock. I think we can. Oh, we could just miss everything that I chuck at him. Oh, Paul feel. Lovely Pokemon though. Who doesn't want a lovely little ball? Um, lovely little ball of fun like uh, like Sveal. Uh, I would like to use that. I would like to keep it at least. And I don't know how deep we have to go into this. But who cares? Well, there's an Omastar there, and there's a TM, so I'm taking out that dude. <laughs> Forget it. Carmen, eh, it's not the best, but it's better than an apple.
coming. Well, put it this way, if there's any move apart from uh, um, Thunder Shock, I'd probably be very worried. But yeah, Magnemite's just not doing damage. At all. Come on. Speaking of not doing damage, I retract that previous statement. Like, I'm surprised we're not seeing any more seals, but damn, like, what's he doing? Like, one hit, one hit point, one, one health point off a of thunder shock, which is super effective. Maddening. Yeah, I've been looking at like those games. Um, like there was Spider Man Two, I was looking at, but then I was also looking at like the games that it led me down this road of like learning about like the Activision games, the like the. Like the uh, Marvel Activision games that just don't get licensed anymore. Because obviously Marvel's... You know, they've moved on to, I think it's... I want to say Square Enix. Who have the uh, licensing at the minute with Spider-Man. With the Miles Morales game. I think it's en Square Enix, right? But yeah, they... You know, those. there's a whole bunch of games that I think are personally really interesting. But that just not... You can't get any more outside. Oh, you can't get them on Steam, which I they originally you could do. Because a big game that I remember is Deadpool. If you remember that game when that came out, like don't think Nolan North was voicing Deadpool. Yeah, in that game you can't uh, have or people don't um you can't get on Steam anymore. Because I think I I really wanted to get it on PC. I was like, oh, can't get it. And then you've got like the Spider-Man games, like probably my favorite, barring Spider-Man 2 when it comes to Spider-Man games, is probably um, Shadow Dimensions, because it was probably the first first time I'd ever heard of something like the Spider-Verse, which I thought was pretty interesting. I like this though, just a whole bunch of sections of rooms, little squares, a bit like this. And we have to find the last one that happens to be the one that's the room we want. Ooh, hello there. Power band. What do I want to take back with me? That's a good question. So is it? A food item that gives the Pokemon cross-eyed status. Sleep status. Um, one thing I should do now that I, now that I know that he knows uh, Nontrea is turn that on. Oh, 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 sorry, that was full time in. Yep. I think we're good in terms of, like, the only thing I don't really want to lose is, I guess we'll eat that final apple. Pick that up. What's the orb? Radar orb. They're good for certain things. Like, they... Oh, are these, like, they, they boost stats? They show you the room, I think. Reveals the location of all foes on the floor. I can do that with the X-ray specs. So, this is real. That's that orb is really useless to me. Yeah, you're looking down this like road of like all these games that go down that were, that were on PC. Because I remember when they were on PC. Like, um, like I said, Shadow Dimensions, Gold Ribbon were taking, and I don't care who knows about it. I just need something to get rid of. Petcha Berry, I am sorry, buddy, but I don't care about getting poisoned when I. Okay, he's steel type. He can't get poisoned. Wait, the gold ribbons there. Gold ribbon is about, I think, 5,000. Uh, 5,000 polka dollars. So it's just. It, it's basically a do you want a new friend area or not? And I think I think I do. Being very lucky with uh, these last couple. Oh, Kabo. Oh, uh, Kabo. Oh, sorry start. Uh, luckily, one of the moves I have left. Does this take a turn up? Yes, it does. Okay. Um, luckily, I do have Brick Break, which does do super effective damage. So maybe with my Brick Breaks, I can hit through, which I can. Okay, and... 
And slowed. Okay, and hopefully I can do some damage. Try a headbutt. Save my last brick break, I guess. Torment. Well, we've already got one torment, so... I'm happy with not being tormented twice. But yeah, you know, like, these games, like, uh, Shad Dimensions, which is, like... You know, first give me the finger for the multiverse. I think it's got some interesting mechanics in it. Like, um, you've got Spider-Man Noir, which is a bit like Batman, which is a little bit like Arkham Asylum's um, Predator sections. Or uh, all the Arkham games' is Predator, Predator sections. Um, 30? Have we reached the magic number? Nope, not yet. Uh, then you got, like, Spider-Man 2099, Ultimate. They all have different feels and different ways of attacking. They all have different villains as well that you have to face. Let's see how I can cringe this guy. I do need to remember that I have got the power band on instead of the stamina one. Thank you, whoever told me that. Aha! Stammy! Love Star You. For some reason, I just don't like Star Me. Maybe it's the color scheme. Maybe because I was a young boy and I'm like, ugh, why do I want purple? Don't know. Well, Star Me never appealed to me. Star, Star You did. Star You was goddamn cool, wasn't he? Star Me blinked. I don't understand the blinking. I didn't know Star Me could blink. Okay, well, I'm gonna chuck my two cents into it. And that's what I get for chucking my two cents in. Thank god he didn't go for another move. <laughs> I got very lucky there. Let's try and get. Oh, Magnum Magnumite, Magnumite. Boom here, buddy. God damn it. Okay, well, Pikachu's hurting, I'm hurting. Let's see what, Let's see if we need some luck. I think I know why Pikachu's always using, yeah, I thought so. That makes a lot more sense now. Yeah, we are hurting, aren't we? I'm looking, I'm just looking at the health bars now of each of them. I did not mean to go that way. Just need a bit more luck. That's all I need. Tiny bit more luck. Do not put me into a room. Do not put me into a room a load of them. Do not put me into a room a load of them. <sighs> Thank you. Very appreciated. You know. Brilliant, Stammy. Um, hopefully that thing doesn't know Bubble Beam. Cool. Fast Thunder Wave didn't work. I'm going to use that elixir up now. And I'm going to hit this thing as hard as I can. Splendid. Oh, brilliant. Love a dead end. But yeah, like, Shad Dimensions, Web of, uh, Web of Edge of Time, sorry. Like, these games, Deadpool. I'm trying to think there's any more. Web of Shadows, that's the one I was thinking of. That's the edgy Spider-Man. Uh, game that I remember where Spider-Man can choose between being Venom and you have like these like weird like Venom Wolverine like creatures because Wolverine's in as well damn it didn't mean to do that um and wrong again I tried to go like this okay well I'm just gonna hit you with that and I'm going to continue hitting you with that, apparently.
in and the on-car ends. Oh, I panicked for a second. I thought that was a, a, seat, a Kingdra. And I, I saw my flash, like my life flash before my eyes. Well, I might do in a minute. Okay, Pikachu, I'm going to need you to use all of your skills in not dying. There we go. Hopefully no more. Oh, thank God for that. Problem is, we could go any floor at any time we could just drop into. And that could be Kyogre, that could be a Kyogre floor, and then I'd be worried. Okay, <laughs> avoid the Kingdra. We don't want to get into fights. We can't really start or end. Um... Gummy, I'm going to eat that. What's the money? Okay. Nice. You know what? I'm just going to... I'm just going to tell you to start doing that and using Sonic Boom all the time. And uh, Super Sonic would be nice as well. Because getting rid of... Frustrating your opponents is really nice. Really? You you had to, did you? Game, well, it's probably close to being dead anyway. Oh, cool. It's apparently just fighting Pokemon Central. Uh, I can hit you with both of them and you'll probably die. Somehow we're making our way through this. I think there's like three times we could have died already. Case in point, make that fall. I don't understand what star me blinking is. If someone wants to put in chat what that means. I have no idea. Or what it... Nice. God damn it. I was like, big area? Surely. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Well. What I get pick in the dog? Um. Yep, and now two of us might be dead. Might be dead. Oh great, I leveled up. Please, no more Pokemon. God damn it, Carvana. I'm begging you. No, no, no. I implore you. Not to get in my way. Hence why I'm using boomerangs before you can hit me. I just need a little time. A little bit of time is all I need. God damn it. I ask for a little bit of time. This game gives me a star me that's going to eviscerate me. Damn it, I didn't mean that. I meant press... Damn it. I swear this game sometimes is out to screw me. <laughs> Was it like 40, 45? I know we're getting quite deep into this, but I didn't expect it. I was thinking around 40, like 30, 40, we'd be, finding the, we'd be finding the depths, you know what I mean? Maybe some like middle ground. Aw, you tease me. You give me a big area, and you take it away from me. What does the warp orb do? Does it just teleport Pokemon to another? Wops foes into the same... In the same room to other places on the same floor. I don't think that's going to work for the... When we're in the... Like heat. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, Bone Club to start off.
And this time, boomerang. I don't think that's going to work here in these like little confined areas. I'm luckily running into tentacle, uh, tentacles, which is okay for me. Because, you know, ground type. Uh, here we go. Do I have any gravel rocks left? No, I don't. Okay, I'm just checking. Yep, that's why I was worried, because he can do that. <laughs> I'd like us to get to some modicum of... Okay, we got the... Woo! <laughs> nah, okay, give it an epic voice. Okay, what, what place your bets? What are we talking? Water, water type? Could be Luke. Oh, well... It's a, it's definitely a, something that's under the ocean, so it's gonna be like Lugia, Kyogre. Any others thinking about Suicune and a push? I think I'm gonna go with Kyogre, it makes the most sense, but it could be Lugia. My power is bursting. My infinite power. Oh, so he's Kyogre, okay. My duel to get crowd on left us both exhausted. I took a long and deep sleep. All the times I waited. Waited for my power to recover. And now, on the verge of regaining my power. I am Kyogre, Lord of the Sea. Witness the destructive force of my waves. Marvel at my awesome power. I mean, okay, you know, a bit full of yourself, but okay. Um, so we're hurting pretty bad. Uh, I'm gonna put on... a uh, power band, probably. <laughs> Just because I need to hit, like, a brick. And... I think this, because this could end very quickly. Um, I think our best chance is just trying to make him flinch. Oh, putting in that big damage there, Magnemite. Well done. Okay, now he's here. Go for anything like Metal Sound, Sonic Boom. So I'm about to give Pikachu the one thing he needs to actually do some damage. Oh, I did not know it did that. Okay. Pikachu, I would like you to... In I should have lobbed it at him. Um, okay, Kyogre's confused. This is what I was talking about, about how confusion's a little bit broken. Okay, full frontal assault, guys. We could do this here, here and now. Um, well then, when in Rome. Hey, I'll take it. I, mean, I didn't mean to strictly do that. Damn, we are really messing his stuff up, aren't we? Um... Push forward. Okay. And now we go back into uh, Thunder Wave and Supersonic Range. Because he could just water move us at any time, and then there goes my existence. So, headbutt. Just checking. Yep. And yep. Okay, he used Ancient Power. Try and use Thunder Wave Pikachu. He used Metal Sound. Now, again. Okay, we got him on the Thunder Wave. Go strictly for the Thunder Ball, and you go for that. It's because I click out, and then I need to click back in. I shouldn't be doing that. 
Get in. I didn't think we'd actually win that. I'll be honest, I didn't think we, we, we would win that, but yeah. See, you see why I took Magnemite? Does little damage. I mean, I didn't realize it was going to do so little damage, but I kept him alive because I was like, if I can get him and Kyogre together, or anybody and him together, and use Supersonic, I can mess him up good style because Super, cause like Supersonic I can get very lucky on. I can get very unlucky on it as well. Yeah, Kyogre. Nice. Doop, 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 doop. Okay, now what's here? Uh, 15 pole, two, two items. First gravel rock, second orange berry. Nationwide survey involving rescue teams. Gravel rocks found to be the most popular item. Going to Sudder Widow Team Fakers let you attack from far away. It's invaluable in the next popular items area. And then new friend areas. This basically is giving you the thing that Wigglytuff's got new friend areas. Woo! I'm proud. I did not think we'd be able to get to the whole way through Stormy Sea without getting, you know, eaten into a pulp. But we didn't. I'm proud. Let's go for something a bit more mundane. Let's try and do... So is it five, six, and seven? The only problem with this is the fact that Wormpull, if hail comes up, we're screwed. Um, who do we want? Who do we want? Trying to take a Pokemon that's strong enough. Or the Pokemon that we think, or that I feel needs like, you know, needs a bit of a, a bit of a level boost. Hmm. What Pokemon's close to evolving right now? Because a lot of these are long evolutions, like I guess Nidoran, but like taking Nidoran moves in there be Eh, let's do it. I'm like, what do you have on you? Nothing. Do I have a power band on me at the moment? I probably have one on me as in Cubone. Um, I will. I am. Was my stamina band? Great. Right, I'll solve it when we get into the actual level. Oh yeah, now I can check if Cubone can level up as well. I don't think I can. I feel like Marowak's for level 30 yard. I am it. Entrance is two now, only room for one. Do you see a Pikachu? Oh, is it because I've got friends with me? Uh, if that's so, that's tedious. In. Let's store all this stuff at the Kangaskhan store. Then we can head off. So we don't need dive anymore. Um, Petra Bay will keep. Scope lens, escape orb, return. Keep one stamina band. Insomnia scope is Pikachu's because we use the Max Elixir. We need to sell those gold ribbons. Anything else we can just, you know. Yeah, stall that. I feel if I'd used the X-ray specs on that let on the in that stormy sea level, we would have been dead. Uh, gold ribbons. Let's see if they have a friend bow as well. Two thousand. Okay, and I was right. I thought there were five. Maybe I was wrong. But yeah, hey, solid money. Nope, I'm good. I just go. Uh, nope. Although I will buy the reviver seed. Any reviver seeds I can buy will be very, very appreciated. 
chicken, take out an orange berry, take out something like two apples, and we'll be good. Uh, orange berry? We need to take the uh, thingy as well. Right, in items. Stamina. Where me? Where's me? Oh yeah, you could choose not here now. Ah, give the stamina band. If we can take two Pokemon, that is. I guess I'll take someone else with me as well. I guess I'll take Magnemite with me as well instead of Pikachu. I forget that they say in the post game, I always thought Pikachu was with you unless you tell him not to be. So, yeah, let's take three of us with us, I guess. And then next time what we'll do is we'll go straight to the, um, straight to that place. So we can see if we can level up. I could find out. I have a book um, that I had when I was younger. It's basically torn to pieces now. I get it now. I'll actually get it. On my bookshelf. Yeah, it's on my bookshelf here. Wormpole again. How you doing, bud? Yeah, Pocket Pokedex. This is before... It's weird seeing not Pikachu be here. Um, just that now. Pick a move. And what is it we need to get to? Level 5, 6, and 7? Yeah, but, uh, Pocket Pokedex, because back in the day I didn't have. Uh, I didn't need the internet to go on Bulbapedia and work out what moves. On what moves Pokemon could learn and what, uh, where could I get certain Pokemon. Bear in mind, some of the stuff in this book is wrong. Oh well, it's not wrong. It's just, um, doesn't tell the. It doesn't tell you completely where everything is. In terms, like, there are Pokemon in certain areas that you can get that other what they tell. That basically it doesn't mention. So, what are we looking for? Cuba and Marowak. Can't remember where Cuba and Marowak are in the Pokedex. This Oh, hello. 104. So, it evolves at level 28. What level are we? 31. So, I can get a Marowak right now. So, we'll have to go and get it then when we finish doing this. Hi, dude. How we doing? One day. One day I'll be able to recruit a Pokemon like an A-bomb. I know we can, obviously, at the minute, because we've got four slots. I was hoping that Nidoran might have leveled up by now. I wonder how much... Or how... I'm going to have to protect you both. So could you not do that? Yeah, you, you, you're going to die in a minute anyway, so... Uh... Case in point. There goes that Reviver Seed I was talking about. Stuff like that's going to kill us. <laughs> I was hoping not to run into anything like that. In. Yeah, I before like Bulbapedia or Cerebi or something like that to tell me what moves Pokemon learn. Uh, for Generation 3, 
I just had this pocket, like, basically like a what? Like a couple inches thick, an inch thick boat. Inch and a half. I'm just telling you, like, here's where this Pokemon is in all the Generation 3 games. So, Fire Red, Leaf Green, Ruby Sapphire Emerald, and then XD Coliseum. Really useful and really useful back in the day for completing the Pokedex. I still sometimes use it now to be fair. It's, it's just I don't use it um, probably. I probably I'll probably use it for streaming if we ever like do something like an Emerald run through, and I don't plan out my uh, encounters. Because when I did my Fire Red run through, what I did was I went through this book. And basically went through like there's ditto so there's obviously the pokemon we need to find yeah i went through that book and basically was like okay um what what different routes can we abuse here to get some pokemon i mean i also did use you know admittedly i used Bulldopedia to confirm everything and then just use the book to basically go over to go over everything and make sure i was right no. <sighs> I didn't even mean to use headbutt. I, I backed out using headbutt. I meant, God damn it. <sighs> well, it's what it is. I saved, right? I can't remember if I saved or not. <laughs> Uh, I'm not. I'm not losing. I. Well, I did kill Kyogre, so cool. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba do 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 Kane, last time you're gonna see my little boy Cubone here. Voice emanates from somewhere. Ye who seek awakening, this is the luminous cave. Do ye seek a new evolution? There are those Pokemon who can evolve, some Pokemon evolve at this spot in certain conditions. Evolution brings about changes in appearance and abilities, not only that. Some Pokemon can change their types and learn different moves. However, requirements for each dish differ, and some become ready for evolution merely by leveling up. Others need special items to attain evolution. So be aware of this. Also, once a Pokemon has evolved, the Pokemon can never regain its previous forms, while you must think carefully before coming to its evolution. Hell yeah! It, will you give an item? No. Why would I? Why would I need to? It's Cubone, level up. Ye who seek awakening, let us begin. I'm undergoing changes. Oh no, I'm going through... I was going to say I'm going through puberty, but that was very quick. You shall return if, ev if evolution is what you seek. Yeah, I'm a cube... I'm a Marowak now. I've got a big bone. Big... for big boys. I don't know if I like it. <laughs> I'm keeping it, it's fine. Okay. Doing all this again. Uh yep. So lesson has been learned. Do not put weak Pokemon in on le on level on certain levels. <laughs> okay, right then. Full ribbon. And we'll toss away the stamina band. Also, what do I look like now, I guess? We're not gonna... I can't remember if we can look at the, um... Like, let, look at my little, uh, face. You know, my image? In my face. Like, like that, the, the Kecleon has. I guess we'll just have to wait. Taking the revive seed. 
I don't know if we can... I'm taking we can rematch stuff like um, Kyogre and all the other legendaries until we, you know, befriend them, I'm assuming. Hedgeberry. Yep. We just need to get some stuff out as well. Doo -ba -doo -ba -doo -ba -doo. And we need pair of... Take an apple. We're we talking, what did we say last time? Three apples, we said, I think. Three apples, an orange berry. If that's here. I think we took the Petra out and then... I think that's it. Oh yeah, Max Elixir, that'd be a good idea as well. Okay, so. Next time, or well, this time, don't take, um, do not take the stupid book, one that makes no sense. Um, C dot maybe. Bulbs naturally by level up, I think. Level eighteen. Yeah, pretty sure. Go get a friend area, and then we'll go on to raw forest again. Attempt free. Hopefully. Let's see, if we can nick another friend area as well here. What are we thinking? Bountiful Sea, a lot of water Pokemon in there. There is a lot of water Pokemon in terms of like, you know, like friend areas for water Pokemon. I guess so because, well, there are a lot of water Pokemon. I think that's the most common typing in Pokemon if I remember correctly. I guess we're gonna go for Bountiful Sea. We'll work from the top and work our way downwards. Okay. And now store the rest of that up. Oh, whoops a daisy. Um Yeah, never mind. Think about something else. So all these Dark Knight relics. Southern caverns. So many places. I need to basically work out what we're gonna do. As in, like, you know, what are we gonna like? Are these? I'll, what I'll do after the stream is I'll look back and we'll see. What I'll plan out my next few streams. Okay. Let's test out this new bad boy. Good start. Good, great start, even. Oh, come on. Seriously? Yeah, then revive a seed, and then I have to restart all over again. Brilliant. I hate this game. <laughs> I didn't even get like any, st what was it, two steps? Two steps I got? God, God damn it. <laughs> like seriously, God damn it. <laughs> Sometimes you just get screwed. Like that wasn't even a bad, what's this name? That was just bad placement of Pokemon. My own stupidity to a degree. Overconfident thinking that, you know, I could take on an Apom. Which I have done before. Ah, uh, god damn it! I'll keep you on. Ah oh, well, it happens. It happens. Actually, yeah, I think we can take through. Um, give you the insomniscope. Oh, we could give you something else, I guess. I don't know. 
I'm taking you, so I may as well. Uh, take Magnemite as well, and we'll just go into it. Ditch all the items and go into it. I'm really, like, miffed about that, to be honest. Was it two steps, though. Two goddamn steps. And all of a sudden, just comes to a crashing conclusion. Oh, well. It is what, it is what it is. It happens. Just gonna check something there. Checking the stream's okay. Everything seems to be in order. Yeah, but oh, that r really frustrates me though, because I have to do all this again. I should save, and I don't, because I'm stupid. Okay. Well, yeah, um, it's just frustrating. <laughs> Well, yeah, that's why this is the reason like case in point this is why no one likes escort missions in games they're awful no one likes them in any game whatsoever because the AI is dumb or oh, some of a you know some of a problem I mean I think we've all the one I think I remember is it golden eye it was that had a, that had escort missions that were, that were particularly bad I've Somewhere in my brain I've got that, you know, rattling around. Uh, yeah, I need to get rid of those gold ribbons. Don't, uh, ooh, don't get rid of the apples, the golden. They are properly golden, we don't want to keep our apples. Uh, bye. By that reviver seed that obviously Wormple's going to use up for the 42nd time. And then what do we get with that? What was it we got? We got the was it Bountiful Sea? Nice name for a friend area, to be fair. I feel like Pokemon Blue Rescue Team and Red Rescue Team are just games you could just fall into, as in, like, you could just, like, spend a whole year on, easily. Like, getting every single Pokemon, doing every single, like, mission that you can. It's, I, I don't know if they're random, I'm assuming they're randomly generated, but you never know. Uh, stamina band, and over. Yeah, I'm not ready to cling, let go of my Cubone yet. Okay, now we need to put our forest. Five, six, seven. And then this time, save. Okay, cool. So what have we got? Uh, yeah, Oprah Forest. Oh, is it something that, um... Okay, and so something in Solar Cave did we, we wish cash say? Okay, cool. I didn't know he... I thought he was telling me that, like... I, thought, I assumed he was telling me about the, like, with the, um... That a move was in, um... Oh, you need a certain move to get into Solar Caves. That's why I've been putting it off. But if there's another move... That we can get... Yeah, sure, we'll do Solar Cave next. So I want those... I want those, uh, I want those um, points, man. I want to be a gold rescue team. I want to see if my... For some reason, I just have upgraded toolbox in my head. I don't want to see if that's true. I was, you know, is it my memory playing tricks on me and it's just the wants of a, a young boy who was bad at Pokemon Red Rescue Team. Oh, thank God for that. Oh, wait. 
I need to, uh... Yeah, I know you have... What, do you have chlorophyll? Speed quickens in sunlight? Does he just use two moves? It threw me off a little bit. Oh, come on, dude. Can we not do this? Thank you. You had to poke the bear, didn't you? You had to poke the goddamn bear. Nope, I ain't moving. I am not moving from this this place. In fact, I'll try and get rid of you by just doing anything. Okay, I'm recovered from confusion. I did say that Reviver Seed would cost us. I really need to take off Growl from Nidoran's moveset. It's just going to cost us so many points. I'm trying to level you up as well, you ungrateful little. <sighs> S-word. Trying to curb my swearing. In all facets of life. Sometimes it gets the better of me. In. Take two electables. Yeah, we're getting there. Just don't. Oh, okay, and I'll take. I'll take that to the bank every single day. I need to find something first, though. Uh, it's destination floor, so we need to find. Was it Ditto? Well, he's not. He's probably not here. Uh, boomerang. Well, that's why I like boomerang. You get two hits at it. Come on, Ditto. Technically, Ditto could be any Pokemon. Need around level five. Good for you, buddy. The reason we're doing this because I. Want to see you evolve. In. Don't be a douche. Thank you. I was like, I was hoping he just won't go next to the A palm. So if he did, I'll. Ooh. In continue with my adventure. Now we can just go gladly onto the sixth floor and get rid of this wormhole. Please. Oh, come on. Okay, first things first. As long as these guys stay where they are, we'll be okay. Could have gone a lot worse, so I'm I'll, I'm happy to take that. Okay, now we need to find electables. How are we doing, Nuzleaf? This time it's super effective on you. I remember that much. Okay, electables, come here. Please come here. You leave the dungeon and you never return. <laughs> yes, continue my adventure. And we come back the way we came. Oh! Oh, thank god he hit me. Oh. Go to this dude. No! Thank god he hit him, and only him. Probably not the best thing to take need around in. Maybe more like Tiny Woods is more hurt, more its speed. Uh, oh, we're almost done anyway. Just need to find one more guy. And we can finally admit we've defeated this. Oh, we've done all the ones in Upper Our Forest. And we can go to other places. Skip Loom. Yes, please. Yeah, I really want to leave. Ok, 
in. And here's my wall. Light screen. Ooh. In. Nice 400. So I need to go to Solar Cave. Okay, and then. And then that must mean Flappy Flap. More friend. Or more friends. Or more, well, no more requests that need doing. The potential of more friends. Buried relic discovered. Po mystery ruin found dungeon. Its site had been hidden by the creator of a meteor strike in ancient times. The buried, buried relic is thought to date back beyond recorded history. There are rumors of treasures and perhaps even Pokemon that lived there in ancient times. Buried Relic is the main topic in Pokemon Square. So if I got to talk to someone in Pokemon Square to get Buried Relic, like I'm assuming it's not going to be these guys, so we'll talk to Charizard and we'll move clockwise. Team got the gold rank, but I think the rescue team ranks go high, can go higher than that. I what's higher than the gold rank, I can't imagine it. In Gramble? Heard rumors. Oh, okay, we might have found it. Heard rumors of Pokemon for ancient times doing buried relic. Oh, well, that was never mind. Treasure to be found in that relic. I wonder how much is true, but I must admit, I do get a certain thrill from it. I guess there's a sense of drama and adventure about it. Lombre, you helped out last time. Oh, you heard about buried relic? They're, rumor uh, they're rumoring that there are treasures in there, and they're treasure and they say the treasures aren't lying around on the ground. You know what they're saying? They're saying the treasures are even embedded in the walls. You knock down the walls, there might be treasures galore. Sounds really enticing, doesn't it? I think Shift Tree knows where uh, Buried Relic is. Where, where is that grass type? I've just murdered part of his family, extended family with C dots. Where the hell is he? There you are, Kane. What? What's that? Where's Buried Relic? Buried Relic is deep in the jungle to the southeast. You dream about the treasures too? <laughs> Me too. Best of luck. Good luck, compadre. Even aside the disturbing fact that Shiftree made them compadres. Hey, Shiftree's pretty cool as a Pokemon. I like the design of it, personally. I just wish it was better in the games that it's prominent in. Okay, and then Frosty Forest. Yep, we read that. We read Very Relic Discovered. I think that was the one that we just got. And New Friend Areas, which is just Wigglytuff. So, Solar Cave, Buried Relic, Solar Cave, Buried Relic, Solar Cave, Buried, buried, buried Relic. Hmm. I want to go to Solar Cave first, since if that's where we can get that HM. It's probably going to be something like, well, going off the ones that we need... Um, or the ones that, that would restrict certain play- uh, Thinking of the HMs that are in this game and the ones that could restrict potential things. Fly could restrict potential ones, but it's a cave, so it's probably not going to be that. It could be Surf, but Solar doesn't really make sense. Um, rock Slide, maybe? I just like predicting, because... Otherwise, I'd, I've got, like, no clue. Uh, we need to go to the jungle and take off that, uh... Not the jungle. Was it the... Safari. I apologize. Got my friend zones mixed up. Can I take that? I can't take the item I give you. Oh, great. Well, I bestow upon thee the most powerful of items. Um, an orange berry. Ooh. The fact that I can't take items from him anymore is a bit weird. We got Magnemite and we got Volts. Got the old gang back together. Now I need to take off a lot of things here. Like all these gummies. 
Keep the free apples. You're going, aren't you, to buy relic? Mama's behind you all the way. Okay, okay, well, everyone seems to want me to go to Buried Relic. Okay. I guess we'll go to Buried Relic then, instead. Since everyone's like, yeah, but you want to go? You, you're going, right? Okay, then, I guess we're going. Um, keep the x-ray specs. If we're going to places new, I'd rather not have them on me. I don't trust myself for one, but, um... Yeah. What do we need now? Dump the apple. Uh, Orange Berry, Power Band, Insomniusco, Pikachu, Petri Berry. Take the Reviver Seeds. Reviver Seeds? We've got them, right? Three left. Hold them dear to myself. I'll hold them dear. Uh, anything else? Max Elix would be very nice. And then I have Ginseng. Drink the boost set power Pokemon's movement also fills the belly. I think with that, we're pretty good. Yeah, I think we're pretty good. Nothing I'm missing. Maybe a Roust Berry, but... Well, it is a relic, so we might find some fire types there, I guess. Who knows? So, I mean, this is all completely new to me. But you know what we've not found yet and we've not seen on our travels? I knew I should have got one. Um, I'm going to get that Reviver Seed off him. It costs 800, but it's worth it. To take two. Here we go. Stall that Persian. Be interesting doing a mystery dungeon game now, because I don't I think they stopped was it generation six? Yeah, it's checking every item is good. Looks okay to me. Let's make a little save. So if we do fail, we can always just go straight back into it. And here we go. So I said we we're going into Solar Cave. But Buried Relic keeps, you know, sticking the finger and poking me. So I guess we're going to have to do that instead. Oh, damn, we are going a fair ways away, aren't we? Uh, is it okay to enter the dungeon with the following rules? Game will be saved before entering. Yeah. Why do I have a worrying suspicion that this is going to take a long time? Your entry has been saved when you're in a dungeon. Quick save your progress before ending the game. Well... Seem to be a lot of things in here. Oh, is this, is this just a way to get a lot of items, maybe? In this, why not? Get rid of this thing as quickly as I can, because I hate Wobbuffets and Why Nots in games. Period. Oh, brilliantly. I forgot about those as well. There are certain traps that are in uh, certain levels. Yeah, I forgot about that. Seems though that Relic Cave is actually quite a... Uh, ...subdued compared to the other ones. Like, it's no stormy sea, because it's like, remember what we... We're struggling to hit these guys for hard damage. These are... Well, we're doing okay damage. Not, you know, it's not great. It's not brilliant. It's acceptable. Again, though, even, you know, new tunes. Maybe 
Maybe I should have had the x-ray specs on for this one. Oh well. Live and learn. What could be in Buried Relic that's so important? What? Sneasel looks way too big though. I don't know how big Sneasel is, but I don't think it's that big, right? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I've just been, you know, underestimating Sneasel. Well, I'm going to do something I've never done before, which is do this and then do that. And we clear a line of them. I think that's rare it happens for me anyway. And what, what have we got? The Max Elixir became sticky and un unusable. Wait, did you just... Did you... I'm going to kill you. <laughs> I can't use that at the shop now, I'm, you know, legs will be broken. Gain Ratake and why not? Okay, let's go in. Any safeguarding them, so that's okay. Love that. And mirror coats on. I should just activate everything on these guys. Splendid. And a bounce band, whatever a bounce band is. But apparently I can't use because it's got that X item on it. Uh, a hold item that makes thrown items bounce off the Pokemon. Not bad, but I don't see the need for it when a lot of the Pokemon don't actually even use the item the items unless they're really chucked at them. It's very niche. But oh, hey, buried relic. Big doll oh so this this is the main thing I was like, do we get citrus berry? Ooh, hello there. What does the citrus berry citrus berry do? In who we've seen before, they should be a couple hits. Or maybe that these are stronger hoot hoots that I need to actually respect. Yeah, I was hoping that Buried Relic, I was like, ooh, that might be like a place where we get a lot of money. And then just classic sticks. We get to chuck sticks at people. Come on, Wisma. Join us. Basically a guaranteed encounter in Emerald that you always will join us in that game. I think that might be the next Nuzlocke I do, actually, Emerald. I've been tinkering around with some of the rules that we can do for Nuzlocke, because I felt like, um... Gravel Rock, make sure he doesn't get away. I could just miss. Oh, well, Pikachu could clean up for you, since... He seems to be intent on... You seem to be intent on not doing your job. Uh, but, yeah, I was tinkering with some of the rules, like, about when to use rare candies. Like, not abusing the system. Um, what are we on? 70? Got any gummies? What's a quick seed do? Again, not seen half of this stuff. Food item that boosts the Pokemon's movement speed by one level. Is that permanent? Or is that a, you know... Like, is that just a thing we, we you know, that happens for, like, once in a level? Oh yeah, I do need to give Pikachu this, don't I? Well, that'll definitely kill him, Pikachu. Let's hit Mon Lee. I'm thinking of stuff we can get rid of, but I kind of want everything here. <laughs> I guess an Orenberry. We what do we have? Three though. Crap. Unclaimed items turned into Pokemon. Well, I guess so. Really? You couldn't just... Oh well. Okay, I think they have, sti they have sticks now. 
See how they like it. Well, you can have your stick back. God damn it. Okay, well, at least it's doing no damage to us. Okay, and keep chucking your sticks. I'll just pick them up and then proceed to decimate your brethren with them when given the opportune. Um, at the, at the opportune time. Okay. There we go, there's the exit. Checking out the stamina band on, I was worried for a second. Warp seed. Um, what does a stun seed do? Just Pokemon cause, cause the Pokemon to be petrified. Guess we'll chuck that. And then stepped on a raw. Well, I want to keep two. Thanks for the damage. How about you have some of your own back? Oh wait, Machop? That's actually a Pokemon we can get off the bat. That might be the first, like, as a, as a, us, like, our Pokemon that we can be. What do the Citrus Berries do, by the way? They're worth taking. Uh, if a Pokemon has full HP when eating this, it will slightly boost its maximum HP and also fill the belly. Well then. Why don't you say sooner? Uh, Arenberry? Yeet. Like in most Pokemon games, you get the Arenberry. And then, you know, when you get Citrus Berries, you toss them aside. And... One of these days, you will join us. Maybe you, Hoo Hoo. Maybe you. Maybe not. God damn it. Damn, it's like a thing here. Like, this berries galore. Well. 87, so I'm not going to chuck away the apples just yet. I'm considering chucking away the petcha berries. Okay. Well. Oh no. What, what's going to happen? Stepped on a totter seed? What is a totter seed? Pokemon that makes the Pokemon confused. Okay. I think I'll pass. Oh, sorry. I'm getting tired of yawning. Okay, and it made sense. Hitmonlee's here, so why won't Hitmonchan be here? Wait a minute, I have no idea where Hitmonchan or Hitmonlee would be. Probably Mount Discipline. Makes sense since the, you know, Pokemon dedicated to the fighting arts. I'm still surprised we have not we've not found like a Frembo or something yet. I don't know where like I said, I don't know where you get them, so. Hey. Well, it's on Pikachu since I think I'm screwed. No, I can still punch it. <clears throat> I don't think I would be able to because you know. Ghastly. You know, no effect. I want to enjoy the experience. I know I could probably play on a quicker speed, but... You know, why not? I just want to enjoy it. I'd miss out on the lovely... 
miss out on the lovely music and just experience and everything about this game. Oh. Welcome to the team, Drowsy. Just don't do what the creepypasta says to children and I think we'll be fine. Oh, I know, well, that's hip now, but you get the point. I mean, Magnemite, why are you looking at me? Attack him. He's the good boy. I wonder how many levels this is, because it's not like they give us a really... I'm trying to think what's the right, right word. Hey. Do we get spited by any chance? I found the... What's his name? Nice! Drowsy making some tea. Uh, Drowsy, do you wanna come pick this up? There we go. It's harder to make mistakes, yeah. That's a good point. I mean, I make mistakes anyway, because I'm, you know, not too bright in the noggin. But, uh, I try my best to pay attention. Iron Fawns. Hmm, I am a sucker for, uh... I am a sucker for these types of things. But I have... Uh, I guess we'll have to leave them. Okay, drowsy. Ooh, hello there. Taunt. I think we've got Taunt at home. I mean, Kanga, Kanga Scan's got Taunt, so I think... Plus, I don't think I'm going to use it. Ooh. Hello. I mean, I probably should have guessed. Okay. Intruder alert. Exterminate. Okay, and apparently Reggie rocks a Dalek. Brilliant. Intruder alert. Exterminate. Okay, boys. We've worked hard on this. Um, go for a growl, because he can't probably hit us right off the bat. Go for a metal sound or a supersonic. I'm going to hit him farther away with Boomerang, because it does a lot of damage. Finally. Um, as we all know, supersonic's kind of busted. Uh, go for a thunder wave, I guess, or maybe a growl as well. I know we want to go for damage, but... Um, I don't really know what, what you want to do, Drowsy. I guess me, uh, meditate if uh, Mag Magnemite dies. Good to know you're following my instructions, guys. Oh. Something fell from Regirock's body. Regirock apparently was guarding the item. Okay. What is it? Rock part. Okay, and fine. Eat the apple. And picked it up. I obtained the rock parts when Re Re Reggie Rock was guarding. What is the rock part, mind you, I ask? Don't know. What, well, can we go home now? There we go. Oh, we can just keep going. Cool. Okay. I did not know about this, so... Oh, wait. I attract. I cannot use. I think we have a tract at home as well. We have a lot of those. Try not to say basic TMs that you get in the, the early game, but... They are. What's the actual info on the... Mysterious item that's jealously guarded by Regirock, however its use, its, use rem, its use remains unknown. I could speak. Oh, come on. Well, this has got interesting. What's an eye drop seed, by the way? Changes the Pokemon stats to eye drops, reveals hidden traps and invisible. Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. Well, now I really want to find the exit. Maybe getting, maybe getting rid of that Petra Berry was a bad idea. Um...
Hmm. I've never heard about that. What is, like, the Cuban Pikachu combo? I've never heard about that. Uh, what do we want to get rid of? I mean, we have Thief. I don't see myself using it. I, do, it, I just want to keep the Apple just in case. Oh, Cubone. Right. To start. It's just like, it's just like... I was like, is this like some like magical strategy that I've just accidentally come onto that was named after someone from Cuba? You know, it threw me off, you know. Usually when something's cool, people get named after it. So I was like, eh, it could be right. Ah, hello there, Noctowl. You appear to be in my way. Oh, I'm sorry, Geodude. Okay, fair enough. They're not the they're not the Geo dudes from what's his name. Uh, they're not the Geo dudes from Mount Steel. They can actually take a punch. And no more poison. Beautiful. Yeah, I, I wanted to pick. Like I said, I, I think I, I think on the initial um, personality test we got Meow, but I was I already pre-planned using Cubone. I was like, I really just want to play Cubone in a game. It, it's just a Pokemon you never really see. Ah. Now this might be an issue. Oh well, maybe not. Because you just don't see Cubone enough in games. Like, they're probably the most. Probably the most amount of times you play as Cubone. Like, I'll. The game you're most likely to play Cubone is in is probably like the Sun and Moon or Ultra Sun and Moon with the fire type. I just like I just like Cubone because it's a cool Pokemon. Plus it's got that, you know. I didn't realize it had the lonely, you know, every time that you level up, it's like, I won't be so lonesome. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, makes me feel sorry for it a little bit. Mind reader, so, uh, attain Shoss. Sure shot status, okay. Whatever that may be. Okay, hidden power, hidden power, nice. Cool. Stepped on a max elixir. So can I take this max elixir and dump my crappy one? And then thief, which you already have. Every time I look at thief, it always tries... I'm always like inclined to say teeth. Having um, I'm for some reason like certain adverts or the games stick out in my brain, and are from like around the early 2010s. Like I remember Resident Evil 6's like ad campaign very vividly, as well as um, Thief 4 when that came out, and I just remember everyone calling it teeth because for whatever reason they did. Uh, I'll eat the apple and we'll take this, the stun seed. Do we really want to go back? Okay, and apparently we're going back. Oh yeah, I probably should put your confusion and your actual attacks back on. Probably a good idea. Yeah, boomerangs. Mmm. Mmm. Beautiful. Ital Italian chef's kiss. Okay, and we could just not hit it with a stick. Wait, can we see if the actual thing is there? Nope, we cannot. I thought I might be able to get a peek. Yeah, I don't know how deep this buried relic is, so I'll just keep going until we find the bottom, I guess. I don't know if there's more. As in, like, if there's more stuff. What seed is here? Blast seed, stun seed, blast seed, stun seed. I like the blast seed. It's a fun seed to have. Just blowing up stuff It's pretty cool. Hello, Metatype. Okay, and you do be calm-minded. That's a bit worrying. I'll just punch you again, just to make sure you're not in my way. Ooh, more seeds. I drop seed. I've already got one. Oh, here comes the Bane. Oh, God damn it! He did the thing. Okay. Pikachu, I'm relying on you to do one thing, and one thing alone, and that is to send this guy back into where the hell he came from. Okay. 
Oh, even those hurt? Pikachu, please. Oh, brilliant. Here we go. I think I might have to take one for the team here. <laughs> okay, no, I don't. Brilliant. I panicked for a second because I didn't know what Destiny Bond... I, I assumed Destiny Bond was a different... Um, a, was different from the... Sticky 10 became unusable. That's fine. Oh, really? Right, okay, I'm going to stop using that. I thought it was a one-use sort of thing. Brilliant. But yeah, I, I assume that <clears throat> Destiny Bond was going to be different in this game than it was to the mainline games. Oh, okay. This is the first time I think they've reused a track, actually. Because this is what Mount Steel, um, Mount Steel is. Okay, more gravel rocks. Appreciated. Um. Do I really want to bounce band over potentially surviving in this dungeon? I think I'll take the apple. Bounce band's cool, but it's very niche when I think about it in reality. What I should have is... Did I... Did I was there an item or a band that stops me? I know I can see all the traps like that, but... I was hoping there'd be something a bit like the x-ray goggles. Haha. <laughs> Two Wobbuffets? No, thank you. I like my sanity. It's a nice thing to have. Okay, and I think a one Brick Brick should actually kill him. So I think we're good. Yeah, I remember, like... Brilliant... Love that Brick Brick just loses all its PP because it gives me a reason to use the Max Elixir anyway. Um, now where is it? Molto bene. I've never actually. I think this is the first time we've seen. Lovely. The good thing is it only has struggle, so I guess we should just attack it as, as normal. Um, but yeah, I remember like, I remember. Teeth coming out before. What's that do? Oh, brilliant. I became confused. Brilliant. My Lesk will wait for Drowsy to sort himself out. Or he could just really like spinning. Who knows? Okay, dead end. Let's hope they none of, none of the other ones jump decide to jump onto that platform. Ugh. I wonder how deep this goes, though, because if... What was it? What was Stormy C, 35? I imagine this is going to be something similar. Oh, boy. Well, we gambled correctly, I guess. Cool. I'm going to hit you with a gravel rock. Oh, how many floors are we talking? Because I literally don't know. Like I said, my knowledge on this game is it goes right up to the point where the where the credits end, and then I have a problem. Okay, and he picked up a petri berry. It was, was it 50 floors? <laughs> oh, well, I'm sitting here for the biggest time, aren't I, I guess. We'll see how far we can go. I'm assuming we need to put the rock part in to somewhere to further where we need to go. Okay, and you went for the wrong one. Uh, headbutt, please. A boy. I think it's I'm trying to think which one it is. Is it Wish Cave that has 99? That one I've heard about. Uh, 
Uh, we got a big dungeon. Pity. I'm gonna start my other visuals as well. These look brilliant. Uh, another Max Elixir. How are we doing on that? Build my belly. Makes me a happy guy. Oh, red. Okay, an intruder alert. In exterminate. Okay, and apparently they've subbed the Reggies for Daleks. Cool. It's like a weird little, um, like cult of Scaro they've got there. Okay, and I want you growling first thing, knocking his ice, his attacks down a little bit. Same with metal sound. I'm just gonna chuck something at it and see what sticks. Okay, and Ori could do that, which damages himself. Not only the best strategy, but hey, who am I to judge? Um, okay. Same with you, Supersonic. We want to status condition this dude to the end of time. Let's see how much Brick Break does, since Brick Break actually a super effective move. Really? Really? Okay, cool. Yep, I didn't mean to do that. Don't matter. <laughs> I didn't realize there was going to be traps in this room. I might have accidentally screwed myself over. Or I could just punch somebody in the face and then have nothing to worry about. Okay, cool. Um, What do we want to get rid of, eh? We've got rid of everything else. I guess sticks, since we can't use them. It's all sticky and won't work. God damn it. Aha! It's sticky and it's a stick. Bad jokes. Very bad jokes. No, god damn it. I can't throw it because it's sticky. <laughs> Swap. Cool. We can leave. Oh, there's something on the ground? I was going to say. I never looked at that ground bef thing before. I should probably eat an orange berry. Just to heal up, just to make sure. So we don't go into any fights. Oh, we, we might get caught in fights that I can't finish. Okay. Hit him hard. Because revenge hurts. And thank god revenge is a multi-turn move. In this game, at least, anyway. Oh, god damn it. Can he pump? Put he put on the pursuit. We've got a problem. We've got a lot of problems. Because apparently, Bone Club's decided to do its old trick and start missing. Oh, so basically, Revenge has got turned to buy. That seems a bit. not good. That seems bad, actually. That seems very bad. You know what we can do? I've just noticed the fact some of the some of these guys' items are not um up to snow. So I think what we'll do is we'll drop the special band. Swap for what? That's a good point. Swap for what? Um, power band, I guess. It's better than nothing. Oh. Right, okay. Magnemite, can I not drop it? Oh, well, he's stuck with it now. I'm fine. <laughs> okay, and brilliant. So we've seen Reggie rock. We've seen Reggie ice. I'm assuming at level, what, 30 odd, we're going to see Reggie steel. Okay. Oh, it was a ditto. Well, there's a wasted, what's his name? A wasted boomerang. Okay, and be very careful. There is. Really? It had to be the citrus berry? Wouldn't be anything else? Okay. Back. 
Okay, and just go around. Do not touch the Shininja. You had to touch the Shininja, didn't you? It was... You know... You're lucky. A silence orb seems very ominous. Like the name of it, at least. Okay. Let's see if we can make it. Oh, well, here's, here's the... Well, we were talking about what... Uh, hit, what... Um, hit, what Drowsy Evolution can do, so I guess we're going to find out. Are you on the same thing as what we are? Yep, just checking. Sometimes my eyes. I don't need. Uh, I don't need glasses. I definitely don't. But that's the, like just the visual. I was like, do I need that? Do I not need that? Here, the blast seed for now. Oh, cool shades. Probably the insomniscope or something like that. Damn it. Well, I'm going about to, I'm going to take a lot of damage. It's the only move that would kill him. Damn, I'll take the crit hit, the crit hit the critical hit. Any day of the week. Ooh, and it's the actual place we need to go as well. How wonderful. Um speaking of citrus berries, I guess we could eat one. Take the x-ray specs, maybe. we. I mean, we already have x-ray specs at home. <sighs> no, I didn't mean to do that, Magnemite. God damn it. I didn't realize you could actually chuck them at him and it'll hurt him. I know you could do that with certain other things. I didn't think it would be, you know, just standard items. Okay. Headbutt. I'm trying to get some of the flinches off from... um. Headbutts in the other store. Uh, we're pretty good there. A law seed. What's a law seed do? Okay, and well, a law seed you're going in terms of the fact that I like Max Elixirs more. And lock on specs? See, that's what I mean. I'm learning about so much in this game just after you finish the actual game. Hold down the raises the accuracy of items thrown by the Pokemon. That would be very useful. Uh, makes the user pounce on a Pokemon in front, however distant. If no Pokemon is in the way, the user leaps into the wall. And the inflicts damage on the target also snatches the target pulled item. Make it the user's, I guess. Pounce orb gone. I guess get rid of both orbs, because I don't see myself using them. I mean, they, they're they sort of sellable and sometimes they're use, useful for item missions, but are they that good? We already have Torment, right? Yeah, we got him Power and Raw. I'm fine with it. The eye drop thing, I think I want to get rid of as though as well. Really, Drowsy? I've just lobbed it and you're like, yep, yeah, he definitely wants it. Go to the Law Seed and pick up this. No, let's go. Oh, brilliant. Can we have a few more levels like that? Thank you very much. Game, was it 20 floors to go? And here's Makuhita. Probably not the Makuhita we know and love. Let's try and use some of these sticks. In, aim at him, and chuck those sticks. What TM have we got here? Oh, brilliant. Yeah, here comes the here comes the pain. Okay, and if I remember correctly. Nope, didn't mean to do that. I'm Okay, and Drowsy, you have one move. I'm giving you the one move that can actually kill Shininja. 
I'm coming. You just gotta, you know. Oh, you could just hit it and kill it. I didn't. Fair enough. Oh, f you can't do flame. Okay, and let's go and save Drowsy. Twist band, whatever that is. Dude, you have Psychic, use it. <laughs> and... Great, lost a Reviver Seed to that. Brilliant. Well, may as well eat it and save us a bit of space. Okay, um... Go for the Boomerang, take out one first, swap out and hopefully... Save Magnemite. Uh, something tells me this is where it might be this is where it becomes a problem. <laughs> In and Pasca, whatever that may be. Hold item that can enable the Pokemon to pass off its off the effects or attacks of certain kinds of hostile moves. Damn, there is a lot of held items that I did not know that were in this game that you can just find. I'm gonna have to have a I'm gonna have to have a proper look up like on on the wiki or something like that just to see how. Cause I didn't think they put obviously they put a lot of time into it, but I didn't think they'd fought this you know in depth. When it comes to thinking about like the amount of items and the amount of configurations and different team structures you could pick. Oh, I love this. Right, okay. Can I not? You're not working? Okay, and there we go. Nope, there we go. Cool. I wondered why it was working out. Or not working out. Um, that's the only reason I have gravel rocks on, because I'm sick to death of Pokemon coming from the walls. I had enough in Sky Tower. I'm quite contempt. Oh. I'm quite content to now use them. Oh, brilliant. Because the warp, warp, one warp tile wasn't enough, was it? Okay, and apparently Pikachu wants to go to the same place. Brilliant. Fortunately, we're right near the... Uh, what's his name? Right near the... Well, what do you want to call it? The stairs to the next floor, I guess we want to call it. Thank God we were, because otherwise I might have lost my mind. I don't think we can actually hit him with a gravel rock unless he's right next to us. Ooh, hello there. Okay, and get rid of your sticks. We've got some stuff to do. Okay, and speaking of, we got one more stick, right? And pick up your new enhanced sticks that probably do less damage going going off my luck. Okay, and here. I'm trying to think what floor is. Will Reggie Steel be on floor 50? I'm assuming, since it's 50 floors. Nope. There's my answer sorted. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Exterminate. Intruder alert. Exterminate. Okay. Like we did last time, fellas. You know the drill. Uh, go for a thunder wave as well. And you go for a super... Maybe... You pulled off and don't go for a supersonic. Maybe go for a sonic boom instead. Um, just let me do the main damage. Oh well, if I could do all the main damage. And I'm in his range to get battered, so... Citrus berry away. Are you guys just 
not going to do anything, you know, use the moves that I have bestowed upon you and instructed you to learn and, you know, told you to do for, to make sure that our game plan succeeds. Okay, well, at this point, he's probably close to dead, so you know what? Screw it and just go for it. Okay, now someone do not to do not touch anything in this room. Okay. No, I want the weird looking thing. Finding the rock part, the ice part, and the steel part. If we let our powers combine, all three parts are yours. Oh, there are three parts. They're reacting to each other. Okay. And became a music box. Okay, so... Law right here. If you get Reggie Steel, Reggie Rock and Reggie Ice, and they're covered in an item together, and you mash all these three stones together, they make a music box for some reason. Music box only needs... Only needs to be in your toolbox for it to attract a special something. I ain't playing that. <laughs> Because I don't know what a special something is. Special something could be a level 100 Mewtwo that could end my existence as we know it. Uh, Sanchru, you're ruining the moment, dude. Get out of the way. And I don't... well... If this was a Gen 4 game, I'd be like, at the end of this dungeon, there's going to be a Reggie, there's going to be a Reggie Gigas. But now I'm, you know, in this generation three, I'm uh, I don't know what's going to happen. Gravel Rock, get to that dude. What trap? My oh no, my special defense fell. What? How will I ever cope? Okay, and let's keep going. 12 floors to go, apparently. 11. Ten. <laughs> How's my item space looking? Yeah, it's full. It's a Rouseberry though, it's just I was contemplating. Don't you even think about it. Oh, you could just not hit the move. Brilliant. That's not thinking about it, but I meant it to the Sandshrew, not you. Oh, great. Level 32. I don't feel as lonesome. I, I just like that. Yeah. I, don't, I just I don't feel as alone. <laughs> Ooh, nine. Okay, and what's the magical thing? Pasca. I think we've already got one of those, so I think we'll... Uh, we'll have to pass on that. No pun intended. Hey, you keep giving me big levels like this. I'm just going to take them and say thank you. Okay. Cool. Got to get those items first. See what they are. Okay, no one do anything... To wake that. I don't know if that's an Alakazam or a Kadabra, because I can't tell because I'm not going anywhere near the goddamn thing. Oh no, it's almost like I've got a move that stops electric type attacks. How wonderful. Uh, is there anything that I'm strictly not at all... I guess I could eat the apple at this point and take the take the seed. And this was another seed, so I think we can pass that up. Okay, and eight flaws. Oh, boo. They didn't initially give me the, the, the next flaw. Boo, I say. Okay, and what's the TM? Raw. Okay. Well, I'm going to lob this because I can see where that guy is.
And just for good measure. On the plus side, we are getting a lot of twist band. What was that one again? It prevents the Pokemon's attack from going... Ooh, hello. That's actually quite nice. What's the music box do as well? Enchanting plays a beautiful man. It's said to draw something special to it when it's kept close by. I don't want to use it just in case something bad happens. I'm very nervous. Um, eye drop seed, I guess, will lob. It's nice, but it's basically like a worse version of the X-Ray specs. In, and then we're leaving. Hopefully the music box has some relevance. Okay. Okay, and we got, it seems we're back to regular flaws now. Okay, and he's using Kinesis, which drops accuracy. I didn't... Yeah, that'll do it. Stepped on rest. I think we have rest again at home. Oh, they got rid of my gravel rocks. Swap for 20. Fine, we'll take rest. Oh, brilliant. Well, here comes the pain. And we found one, we found two. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Reviver Seed's there. We're taking the Reviver Seed. I just got to work out what in my brain that we're going to, you know, get rid of to make room for the Reviver Seed. Reflects okay as well. Um, I guess the Blast Seed. And we'll save Magnemite. I do keep getting lucky and finding certain flaws at the right time, though. I can't, I, I can't not admit to my luck. Okay, and you want to throw down? Rest, well, haha, joke's on you, you've already got rest. Okay, nearly there. Six more flaws. Five more flaws. I really need to start saying that more often to keep finding them. Okay, and what was the item we dropped? Oh, okay, it's an orb. Leave it. Probably not worth it. Oh, hello there. What is this? Okay, and I'm going... Do I play the music box here or something like that? You know, I don't know. Okay, remember, left-hand corner. Maybe we have to find a key of some sort as an item. Um, We've got, like, what was it, two max elixirs that we can use? I think we can use one and pass it up. Okay, well, there's the next floor, but I want to know what that key thing is. Aha! Hello, all. Okay, and now... That'll do it. I want to see if there's an item, like a key or anything here before we leave. If not, I'm looking it up, so I really want to know what that is. Use that last silver spike. Because if there's an item, we need to make room for it. Not very nice. Well... Here, I mean a bit of a quandary. Can I hit one of those for a change? Maybe. You know, just hit one of those doubles. We had problems against. I think it was Reggie Steel. Can we not do that? Okay. So what is that 
them dolls for? Do we need a key of some sort? Because I have not seen any sort of keys. Yeah, none, none of the none of the jingling jangling variety anyway. Um Maybe it's the orb, that's why I've come back. Okay, and I'm just gonna look up what the like the key door was or something, and then we'll continue, okay? Okay. But we don't have a key. So I assume that we are probably screwed. We may have to come back here at a later date. It's okay. Well, if I don't have a key, I don't have a key, you know what I mean? We haven't come across a key. I remember coming across a key. Damn, I like it took that thought like a champ. Oh yeah, I forgot we got rid of uh, my wasp's names. My gravel rocks. Just, you know, let him do it. Let him, you know, get over it. And then we can punch him in the face. Or headbutt him. Unfortunate, but... So, now I at least know we can get HMs at certain places to unlock certain things. Cool. I panic then, because this is like, like, the end. <laughs> know what I mean? Uh, oh yeah, I should have looked at all the music boxes as well. Well, doesn't matter now. It's probably useful. I swear to god, if the music box gets me a key, I'll lose my entire mind. Ah, oh, boo. I was hoping it'd lead me to the e exit. Uh, headbutt. And headbutt again. Splendid. Gotta find... Ooh. Insomnia scope, which we've already got, I guess, technically. Um... Gravel rocks. We've got more gravel rocks, maybe? Is there anything... I don't even want to pass anything up. Gravel rocks is up. They're only there for... You know, they do 20 damage. It's not like... It's not a big thing if I don't pick them up. Okay, just avoid the Kadabra. Do not annoy him or her in any single way or form. Because we might be in... We'll be in the... You know... We'll be having some troubles if we are... In and the orb. Come on, give it to me. Yeah, that's my boy. Ooh, nice work, Pikachu. In and one more. We just need one more floor. Neo, no stick cap. Okay, and we got rid of the, that. Let's see if the can Drowsy. Swear to God, come on, Drowsy. You got to fight, buddy. And you fought. You fought more than bravely. What's the no stick cap do? Cap that prevents Pokemon, uh, prevents the item from becoming sticky and gummed up. Well, you know what you can do, Drowsy? Actually, now we're talking. Now we're thinking about it. How about you swap that for what's on the floor? Okay, maybe not. How about I toss something and then we get it back? into a trap when you times turn into a Pokemon that is fine love that okay oh come on okay fine you asked for it
Really, Pikachu? You're not gonna come up, come in and help me out? You're just gonna stand there? Well, that's just what Boomerang was meant for, I guess. I'm just gonna heal up. Uh, Citrus Berry. You guys, sort yourselves out. <laughs> Okay, and try and get rid of these sand shrews. That buys me a little bit of time. Um, really? It had to miss, did it? Okay. Uh, I guess we're going to have to go for another citrus berry. Oh, crud. Well, might have doomed Pikachu, I guess, but I'll try my best. Get rid of the ground type. That's the good, st good start. Yep, that's why I had the Reviver Seed on. Put another move on, thingy. Fair enough. That's my own fault. Okay. Now we just gotta remove the end of these guys. Or the rest of these guys. Okay, and there's two. There's one. And there's zero. Usually they do, they do give you a decent TM though at the end. I think we got, what was it, Ice Beam we got last time? Really? A taunt I can't even use. Levels do not understand. There are not levels to my like, just sadness right now. Wait, it doesn't end? Can I not leave? I was hoping, we, like, you said 50 levels. I was expecting to leave after this. Does this not end? <laughs> I want to go home. <laughs> okay, and I think what we'll do then is because, you know, with my um, definite modded DS, I can make a save state, potential save state, and save at this point, and we can continue next time. How does that sound, huh? I think mean, that sounds pretty damn good. So we'll just take out these two guys while I'm doing my outro. So I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Uh, the people on people on Twitch, all these get archived to YouTube. The, if you ever miss a stream, there should be a link down below from where you're watching this video. That's where it'll be. Uh, for people on stuff like um, Rumble, on YouTube, or anywhere else, any other platform, all these get streamed live from Twitch. If you want to interact uh, and watch live like people have been doing today, you're more than welcome to. Um, there should be a link to, in the description of every video that I do to the Twitch channel. I'd like to thank you guys for watching one final time, and bye bye